Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of A Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here with... TNT Dynamite, the explosive one, Jonas, you're the man on the sticks. I am. And uh, we're playing that Madden 21 for that AL. Mm -hmm. That it, ow. It is for that ow. That ow. Yes. Ow, ow. Ow, ow, ow. Da, 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 ow. Yes. I heard a long time ago is that music was going to go back to uh, that kind of like being the form where it was more like uh, instrumental. Like, like people are going to get out of like listening to music with lyrics and stuff. Uh -huh. I don't know if I see that happening now. Uh, no, I but like if, lyrics. Uh, but if you think about it, like back then, like in 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 those nineties, we always go to the night. I hate that too. Uh, but back then, Jonas, like there was a lot of songs that were just like instrumentals. Like what? Like that song. That song was like that. No, that was just the intro, and there were like lyrics to that song. But that song was like all instrumental it like started out yeah grooves in the heart yeah, yeah you could just play that and people be like hell yeah and then there was like any labouche song yeah you could just play any labouche yeah I don't, know. I don't know i don't know i feel like you're giving a lot more i think there's not as many examples you don't you. think there's a lot of those i don't think so no no i mean the spin doctors they they were out there Did they if do? you want to come in maybe that's about the song yeah yeah but that was just bad lyrics <laughs> i mean i like that oh, yeah. song too oh yeah they're bad lyrics for sure i get that that was just bad song but whenever i hear that i always thinking oh, i said what about a breakfast at tiffany's and she said, I think I. Yeah, dude, I feel you. I like that song, John. That's a good song. That's, yeah, I like that's lyrics. A banger. Man. I'm a lyrics guy. Uh, you know. I remember I used to listen to this Icelandic band back when and I was younger called Sigur Ross. Okay. And it had no lyrics, and it was all. It was a guy playing like an electric cello, or he played. He played like a cello with a violin uh, bow, or maybe the other way around. He played a violin with a cello bow. Either way, it was. They have this. It's a, that option said solidarity, and when he got a first down, he put his fist in the air. That's awesome. Yeah, I was like, I, I did never see that. I was like, what is that? Anyway, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. So, <laughs> so but like, I was like, I was just thrown aback that that was an option in the game. Anyway. Yeah. Either way, uh, they made like uh, they made like songs that uh, just like use utilize a, a makeshift language that like the writer or the group singer just like made up apparently okay so it wasn't even in icelandic and there's no way you can understand it but it was just about like appreciating the harmonic vibes yeah and the listening to the music and it was good stuff too, too i like man. i like how when you have um me just music you can tell a story with just the music yeah like you ever did you ever see vanilla sky with tom cruise yeah uh, yeah, that's, I mean, a long time ago. I don't remember like, a lot about it. The iconic song from that Vanilla Sky is uh, one of that Sigur Ross band's uh, songs. Yeah, if, song. yeah, it's like, one, like I've never seen Vanilla Sky, but people have told me that it's the song where he's like on top of the skyscraper and he's falling off or something. Do you not remember that? No. All I remember is uh, when he messed up his face, like in the Kanye song. I don't know what? That didn't mess, Kanye didn't mess up his face. Yeah, he did. He did not mess his he, face up. He was up. in an accident. That, that does, yeah, but like that doesn't mean he messed up his face. His That's face, how Tom Cruise messed up his face in the movie. His he, face he got messed up. <laughs> there's, there's different connotations between he messed up his face and his face got messed up. What if he up. was at fault in the accident and he messed up his face? All right, so if I punch you in the face, do you say, yeah, my face got punched? No. <laughs> You're not going to say that. You're going to say, this motherfucker punched me in the face and I'm calling my lawyer. Kanye said in his song, I was like Tom Cruise in Vanilla Sky. It was televised. You know, so he compared himself. <laughs> yeah, but Tom Cruise didn't mess his face up. He, had his, he got his face messed up. <laughs> he drove off a bridge. He did it to himself? Yes! 
Oh, yeah, he messed his face up. <laughs> right? He, he drove his face off a of bridge. I don't know what happened in Vanilla Sky. I didn't see it, dude. I feel you. Oh, my God. I just double tapped it and threw an interception. <clears throat> Why did you do that? Because the game's delayed, and I hit the A, and it didn't snap the ball, and I hit A again, and then it caught up, and it had already snapped and threw to the A receiver. Mm. Online, dude. Get it. Mm. Catch them all, bruh. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, yeah, I never saw the nose guy, but I don't think Kanye did it on purpose. He wasn't very good. He was, no, I don't think he did it on purpose either. Kanye West was in a... I don't know the story of that accident. I don't even know what happened. Uh, he's told it before, but I don't care. It happened like a billion years ago, and he's a millionaire. I'm sure his money... Famous, yeah. yeah, I'm sure his money makes him feel great, you know? I'm sure his money makes him feel great. Yeah, well, look, dude, come on. What do you, what do you want from me? <laughs> I mean, you want me to feel bad for him? I mean, he's got a Kardashian as a wife. Yeah, he's good. And he's got a million dollars. And more than many, that. Many millions More than that. Yeah. yeah, dude. I'm, yeah, what do you want me to do? <laughs> you want me to feel bad for him or something? I, and look, it's not like like he's he's like he's not immune to pain and human of like just basic human interaction like we are. You're, you're just saying if somebody's rich, you don't feel as bad for them. No, and see, that's not what I'm saying. That's <laughs> I mean, not what I'm saying. But if I am going to account how much money a person has, then, yeah, I'm going to feel bad for the person who messed up their face or got their face messed up and they're broke. Way more Another than I am for the person. I'm really good way more than I am for the person that has enough to get plastic surgery done and just fix it. That's true. You know? Like yep. if my face got messed up, dude, I'm just I, I'm just gonna be a messed up face for the rest of my life. Yeah, I feel you. Unless you losing by a lot already. Unless they subscribe to our Patreon or our OnlyFans, I mean, and yeah. donate to the Patreon. You got to get on. Oh, look at that! I would put up an OnlyFans, Jones. We could put up some pictures. Are you gonna put up? Uh, like, it doesn't have to be. Pictures? Doesn't have to be sexual. Mm -hmm. I could like show my elbow. Ooh, dude. Feet picks, Jonas. Feet picks are going right now. There's, oh, they're hot. They're, they're popping. Selling like hotcakes, man. People love to see other people's feet. I don't get it. It's either like it's a. It can be like a real fetish, or it can just be for the memes. It'd be like, oh heck yeah, dude! Show me your feet. Show me your feet, dog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dog. Show me them foot. No, but nobody. What? Why, why do you speak in? Uh, you speak in blackface. What? <laughs> By saying yeah, dog, that's blackface? That's that's verbal blackface. Is it really? <laughs> Who are you imitating with that voice? I'm just saying yeah, pit, dog. Pit, picture the man. <laughs> I'm not imitating anyone. I'm just saying yeah, dog. I didn't realize I had to imitate someone by saying a word. <laughs> wow. Now I'm never going to say it again. Now you've, now you've <laughs> Did I make you think about all the times that you're speaking in verbal blackface? I, I, no, I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. I mean, it's okay. Actually, I, I heard that terminology used the other day, and I thought it was the most ridiculous thing I ever heard. And then verbal I was like, blackface? you know what? And I was like, you know what? There is there is some instances where where people probably do do that. Like, if I were to walk up and I was like, hey, what's up? And then it was like, hey, what's up, bro? I'd be like, yeah, that's verbal blackface. Okay, I get that, yeah. <laughs> that's like, verbal yeah, blackface. Yeah, it's about, like, tone and situation, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I guess, yeah, I guess there, that is, I guess that could be a thing, for yeah. sure. If it's, if, if, if the way you are speaking is spurred on by the way another person is speaking, it'd be like if a, of, if, like, a Indian person came in with an accent and you started speaking with their accent. Right. Like, what the oh, hell are you, yeah. why, why would, why, why would you do that? Or, like, uh... Or, like, if somebody's, like, the other, th and it's not even, and it kind of goes into non-things like that, too, like, because if somebody's, like, if you're, like, at a place and somebody's, like, acting a fool and you're, like, hey, dude, I was, like, hey, chill out, bro, and they're, like, what, you got a problem, bro? Like, they're, like, coming back at you, like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, whether you're, you're both white, you're black, whatever, <laughs> but if, like, it, it's, like, intent and, like, connotation. Yeah, it's situation. definitely intent. It's definitely big on intent, but on the same note, like I said. If if a black person gets in your car and then you start using every bit of slang that you've ever heard in your life 
to either a make them feel comfortable or b make people feel be, way more uncomfortable because you're uncomfortable. Yeah, it, this is like what? and that does happen. Yo, why are you talking to me like that? That, that does happen. I mean, well, you, you know, dude, movies and stuff like somebody uh, brings home, like somebody brings home like a, a boyfriend and he's like a black dude, and then the dad's like, "What's up, dude? Or what's up, dog? Or bro?" And they're just like. <laughs> you never talk like this. Yeah, Why are you talking like this yeah, right now? Yeah, don't talk to me because of who I am. Right. <laughs> talk to me because of who you are. All right. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. If you try to match the language or phrasing of some or the accent of someone that you're around, yeah. that is that is that is. Uh, oh, funny uh, enough, Jones, I've, I've never encountered that before. So, you know, that's why I can call it. <clears throat> Interesting. <laughs> I've never once encountered that as ever being a problem in my life. <laughs> never. Never. I don't know. You know, I do do it if, like, somebody comes in with, like, a weird, uh, I don't want to say, like, accent necessarily, like, in a racist way, but, like, I feel like if somebody has a southern drawl, I may be, I may be a little inclined to... <laughs> oh I'm yeah, a, I feel like I've yeah. done that, but maybe I have. Like, I've been talking in verbal whiteface all these years. Verbal bro. whiteface. <laughs> have I been? Have I been speaking in a verbal whiteface? I don't. I don't know, dude. I'm have not I sure. been putting verbal Cool Whip all over my face, Jonas, to appear a different shade? Verbal white. Verbal Cool Whip. Yes, Jonas. I feel guilty and I apologize. I, I don't. I'm not. If, there's nothing to apologize to me about. If I've ever come to you and I sound more Caucasian, I, Jonas, the way I'm talking right now, this is really how I talk. I promise you. All right. I, I, uh, <laughs> I don't speak Ebonics all the time. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> this is how I speak. It can't be helped. It can't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm not trying. I'm, I'm not, not trying, trying to offend you. I promise. Not trying to match your words. I assure you, I'm not trying. to <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> it's all attention. I don't know, dude. That was. I like that bit. Yeah, we, we have to revisit that one one day. Yeah, I like that. I mean, that I feel like anything we put on any of these video game videos can always be revisited because. Yeah, but we won't remember them. We don't. Honestly, it's so funny. We'll sit here and we'll record uh, videos, and we do have a little bit of a backlog. Backlog is pretty apparent. Um, but we record videos, and then as soon as we're done, we'll be like, eh, you know, we'll both go to our phones, and <laughs> then we'll be like, all right, now what do we talk about in that video? Yeah, because I need to, like I need to put like a little I put like a little note in the file name so I know what to name the video. Yeah, yeah. So like yeah. then I'll be like, what did we talk about in the video? Like when we like this is thirty seconds after the video is over. Yeah. I literally have to say more probably at least half the time. What did we just talk about? And yeah. that's because I really cannot think of what we just spoke. Yeah, about. and then we'll just end up listening to it. That's how I do it when I uh, when I upload videos as well. I'll I'll just listen to the video and then like. <laughs> some keyword will pop up and I'll be like there we go right or like you know sometimes like I'll just listen to like a 10 second clip and I'll remember a ton of stuff we talked about yeah yeah and that's it's, it's just it's just really weird how if you were to ask me with no prompting whatsoever what we talked about 20 seconds ago I don't remember right but it like you hear a snippet and you're like oh I remember that entire conversation <laughs> yep word for word oh my god I just the same thing happened again why is the effing lag so bad? <laughs> God damn it, man. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> oh, it didn't snap the first time, so let's snap it now and then throw an interception because you tapped the ball twice. <laughs> God. How much is audio important in this game? What do you mean? Uh, well, in like games like first-person shooters, audio is very important because it can give away enemy position and certain footsteps can signify what character or what item they're carrying or, or whatnot. And I didn't realize, but it, it's it's very important in, in a lot of games, like just audio cues. How important is audio cues in this um, game, do you think? Audio cues in Madden are not very important unless you're on defense and you're trying to like jump the snap to get like a... a try to get to the quarterback faster or something but like it's hard to pull off in like a video game anyway so it's not really 
No, I can probably play this on mute and be all right. Because I control when I snap the ball. I control when I throw the ball. I can, you know what I mean? It's right. not very much, it's not much auditory. Fair enough, fair enough. Yeah. But, you know, if the game lags and I hit the button twice, <laughs> there's not much I can do about that. <laughs> Ooh, that guy, he's he's not a happy man. Nobody is. Are we are we losing right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were down by twenty four points. I'm coming back. <coughs> oh. Yeah, we were we were down by a lot. Why, yeah, why a are you a whole lot, dude? Why are you making us lose? Because I want to make it. I want to make it a uh, a way to. We're down by. We got thirty five seconds, so if the defense might lose it for us, but we'll see. And that is the big two seconds. Yeah, we oh, lost. you can do it though, dude. Hail Maris. Yeah, I, ha I do. I mean, there is a chance. Get out your rosary beads, kids. I can't, dude. This game loves to just s in your cereal, dude. <laughs> it's like, oh, you give thirty seconds. Of course, they're gonna let a touchdown happen. Why wouldn't they? <laughs> you should never play Spelunky too. And I was in the middle of throwing the ball, and it didn't throw because the guy touched me. Boom, yeah, we lost again. Yay. You can't get touched, dude, in the middle of throwing your balls. Boop, 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 boop. That's so. the worst. All right. Well, that is all the time that we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you've already done that, this dude does Twitch things. TNT Dynamite. I'm funny elsewhere as well. Yes. Uh, TNT D-I-N-O and my G-H-T underscore crazy town at twitch.tv. Heck yeah, for Jonas. TNT. Uh, we'll catch you on the next one. We are out the...